have a rare thing for us, a blind unboxing, because usually we kind of like to know what we're getting in advance, but these are from Creepy Co. And they are like keychain bag clips, like whatever you want to use them for. But they are kind of like these old school, like um, they're based on these old school vintage Halloween designs. And so we thought, you know what, old school vintage Halloween, we can't hate any of these. So it's good for me to get a blind box if I know there won't be anything that I won't want, then I'll go for it. Um, these are $6 each, which is a really good deal because they're like three or four inches long. They're good sized and they're little plushies and they're good for decor. You can get a boring bag that you have to use if you don't have one with Halloween stuff on it and stick it on there and it will look cool. Um, so we are gonna see what we got, but first Gomez can show what's on the outside. I'm Morticia if you guys are new and Gomez will be showing you the box and the other variants that we could be getting. Well, the suspense builds. And if you guys are new, check out our spooky playlist, subscribe and hang out with us. So in this series we have the scared Jack O' Lantern. It's an adorable pumpkin, I have to say. Are, are, you, would... are you hoping we get him? Yes. Okay. Then we have a classic skull that seems smiling with red eyes and a cute pug of a nose. I do, I'm not really into all skulls. I'm very skull picky because usually that's the first thing you can find, whether it's on decor or jewelry or anything, you can always find a damn skull. And I know a lot of people love skulls, and I do have some, but they're all kind of like more unique because to me it's just kind of boring otherwise, but that's just me. But that one, I like the red eye concept. Yes. And uh, the kitten face also looks adorable. It's the Mischief Scratch Cat. I um, want a cat. Yes, especially that kind of black, beautiful. I didn't know about the skulls. I never saw anybody unbox a skull, and if they showed them on the box, I forgot. So that's convenient because I'm not really into skulls, and I might have been afraid to get that I would get a skull. But I, I don't mind the fire in the eyes. I can think about Bob from um, Dresden. <laughs> I like that. And the next uh, cat is a different variation. It's called a Happy Scratch Cat. Do you like Mischief or Happy better? Um, they're both so cute, but maybe Mischief looks adorable. It's what I call, when I think about pumpkins, I call them wicked when they have that uh, happy snarl. So this cat reminds me of such pumpkins and his expression. He's happy about it. He's like our gremlins. They always seem like, yeah, but they're happy doing it. They're yeah. Really they're like enjoying it. They're wickedness, like we are. Yes. Yes, okay, so we wouldn't mind either cat, but we, we wouldn't mind getting the Mischief. I thought about him too, but I wouldn't mind either, so... Yes, the happy cat also looks adorable. He seems to have also nicely developed fangs. Uh, the main difference is in his eyes, where his eyes appear to be more slitted, where the other one has just regular cat-like eyes. What about uh, coloring? Uh, the colors seem to be the same in both, where it's a white outline and black iris on the inside. What about the, cat, the rest of the cat? Um, the rest of the cat is not shown. We're only featuring the head here. And overall, I wonder. That's what I was wondering. Is it just the head that you get, or is it the whole cat? If anybody got a cat, let me know. If you just get the head, I think you should get the whole cat. I would like that better. But yeah, if we don't get a cat, tell us if it's the whole cat body or not. Yeah. And the next one is a fire variant skull that looks uh, similar to the other skull, except that it happens to be entirely red. Not bad. Yes. At least they're more unique for skulls, I'll give them that. So I guess I'd rather get something else, but I won't hate it if we get a skull, so. And then we have a goofy jack-o'-lantern uh, by name, but the expression does not seem to be goofy to me. Like some things that are goofy really look silly, but this one looks more like shy and reserved than goofy to my mind. So I would still like it as much as the scary one. And then we have the classic Betty Ghost that's a white ghost with a black bat. It's so cute. I thought about this and I sent um, an image of it to Haunted Bat and I was like, this would be good for you because it's a haunted bat because the bat's in the front and the ghost is behind like haunting it. I was like, that's so cool. And this was like right before Halloween. I was watching unboxings of these and saw these and went, I need to get these. But we had been shopping a lot of Halloween so I thought, you know, it would be more fun to wait and get these when there's not Halloween stuff in stores. You know, just to give us a little extra Halloweeniness in between waiting for Halloween. So that's what we did. 
And the next is another variation of the Ghosty, but it's a Moonlight variant Betty Ghost. And it looks all in green, where the accompanying bed that it's holding is also black like the other one. Uh, so they're similar in structure to each other, just different colors. I think and they're both delightful. Yes, so it's really exciting. It's it's like no matter what we get, we won't not want it. So that's the only time I'm going to risk a surprise box, you guys, is if I won't mind no matter what it is, which is a rare thing. And that concludes this series. Okay, let's see what we're getting. Let's see. I'm opening. Just tear it. Be rough. Be I'm going to show you the opening itself. Here it goes. I'm unveiling. One, two, three, four. Something is inside. What is it? Yeah, I hope it is. If not, that would be a bad surprise. <laughs> Yay! It's the Moonlight Ghosty. The Moonlight Ghost. I was also telling Gomez we're each going to get one, so if it happens to be a repeat, it won't matter when you share it with somebody else and you each get one, so there's not like two. That's why we only order two, because if you order three, one of us can still get stuck with a, another one. That's a good point. We have the math worked out. <laughs> we'll decide who gets what when we see what the other one is. He's big, though. Look, see? Yeah. Like, that's not bad for six bucks. That's a good deal. Here's he head to toe. Does he feel soft? He does feel very soft. Like velvety? Yes. I like, velvety, like the kind of plushies we got at Rite Aid for Halloween. Very pleasant. Would you like to play with him when I open the other? Um, is like a kind of big lobster claw sort of so you could put these on it or stick them on a bag and I think it's equally workable. Or you can attach a key ring to his little link under the clip and then put it on a bag. Yay, another ghosty. But that's the white one. Yes. Alright, well it was almost a double but not really thanks to coloring. Now the bat is kind of like maybe glued on to the ghost, but it looks very sturdily glued. I mean, if you let a little kid play with it, it could probably tear it up because that's what little kids do, so I wouldn't. Um, but otherwise, the bat looks like it's on there well. I wish it was sewed on, but I think it was glued. I could be wrong. Maybe it was sewed. I don't know, but um, I would be careful. But it looks like it's sturdy as long as it's not pulled on, you know, so. And here's the ghost to side by side with its own illustration on the box. Oh, do you want to show the two together and give them back to you? Yes. I want the white one, and then you can have the moonlight one because you're a moon baby. I am. You are. I was even born on a Monday. That's why I said you're a moon baby. <laughs> 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 I think I was born. Was I born on a Friday? Or? I can't remember. I think so. Was it? Yeah. Like, I am a party person. I like the weekend. I'm kind of <laughs> And my mom was like eating chocolate when she was in labor with me because she was hungry. So I'm like a chocolate nut and it's all her fault. It's <laughs> little... I would say fun facts, but I guess strange facts. 50 facts about us. <laughs> yeah. I don't think I said that in our 50 facts thing. Too bad. We, we would have to do a well, sequel now. Yeah. <laughs> so the ghosts are friends. They can hang out with little bat friends. Yes. You good with the moonlight one? I am. Okay. We're, we're both happy. There was no fighting. And we each got something, so that was cool. That was a good experience. I don't know that I would order more because of the fact that I, I don't want doubles. So I probably won't unless go as really need something or... Those pumpkins are done. Oh, I like, get more one day. I saw somebody else from an unboxing and she said that they were like, no, I'm going to get more. Which I guess I could trade, you know, so maybe we'll get more. Who knows? <laughs> Time shall tell. But those are really cool. And um, the only thing is shipping took a while, like it took a minute to get here. Um, they, the boxes came in this kind of like tightly done saran wrap and I did take that off before we started because it took a second and I just didn't want to bore you guys with like the waiting. So anyway, um, they did come in those, little saran wrap and then over the box and that's how they came. So yeah, we hope you enjoyed and until next time. Stay spooky, my friends.